Hello Habibi here continuing the tutorials about creating some racing game in this part of my tutorials I'm going to add buildings into this game because it is an easy tutorial I will go to asset store to download some free buildings you can find free building you will find a bunch of free building assets here for example this one or this one apartment buildings only 10 megabytes click download button now we are ready to import it import everything let's go back to the scene find the building folder here go to prefab folder and this is the buildings we only have two free buildings here let's grab and drag and drop it to the scene let's position it correctly scale it up scale it up more a bit I think this building is too small but it's okay let's drag it upward a bit and also drag move the water position or sea position upward <coughs> don't worry this building is not floating on on the top of the water I will add terrain later it's good now drag and drop the next building not that one this one we can copy the position and the scale setting of this previous building and paste it here now let's just move it maybe we can rotate it in minus 90 degree So it is funny if the buildings are floating on this water so I'm going to add a terrain here right click and create 3d object choose terrain the size is okay I drag it and position it here now I can and opacity increase this brush size we can raise the surface of this terrain by using this brush 
let's start raising it here also well, this one and also this one oops let me raise it here maybe it is an island or something okay it is enough let me drag it down a bit I need to see the water I think it's good we have the rain now and but we don't have the texture I'm searching for a free seamless grass texture and we can grab some maybe this one or you can even do this one it is up to you but let's open up our working directory click this one show in explorer here inside asset folder i'm going to create a folder called texture now drag and drop the texture file image here and rename it go back to the unity and find the texture here we have the texture click this terrain and choose this paint texture and now add the texture here select newly add a texture let's find a dirt texture rename it to dirt go back to the unity and add another texture now we are ready to paint the dirt texture we can choose the brush preset i choose this one and now i can in, uh, decrease the size of the brush and texture it here we can increase the opacity okay i think it looks good okay let's go run this game here is the game and thank you for watching this tutorial see you next time